There's a fish. Uh, did no, I, yeah, I still got him. It's a Spanish. Hey, how's it going, everybody? Today we're out here on the Mayport Jetty. He's going to try to catch some Spanish mackerel. Uh, started getting burnt out on the bass fishing, so I want to try something new. And I don't know if you can see him, but over my shoulder right there is Mike with Get Out the House, Go Fish. He decided to join me today trying to get some of these Spanish mackerel, and he's going to sit up down the rocks for me a little bit. So uh, it makes me nervous using this very expensive DSLR camera right here on these rocks. So I'm going to hurry up and end this and uh, put it away so we can hopefully do some fishing. All right, let's go see if we can catch any toothy critters. like the basic setup I got a 4000 series pin or I wish it was a pin just kidding it's a casting Centron 4000 series ugly stick intercoastal seven foot some 20 pound fluorocarbon leader going to some 30 pound braid or not braid sorry number three wire which is 30 pound test to a gotcha plug well this is a tsunami knockoff it'll work and we're just throwing out here and I'm gonna dig it you see right now currently the tide's going out and the water's pretty clean for out here in uh, north florida anyway in st john's river usually this will look like coffee so we're just going to go out here and jig this and see what we can get go pro There's a fish. Uh, did no, I, yeah, I still got him. It's a Spanish. A nice Spanish. Get up here, dude. Heck yeah, that didn't take long. That's what, that's what we're after. The gotcha plug. Now the game is not to get hooked. Bro, you can just chill out for a minute. Literally chill out. <laughs> All right. There's one, Mike. Yep. Another Spanish. Oh, we got off. It was a good one. A good keeper size thing right here all right guys i had to stop there for a minute so i swapped out reels i took the 4000 series off and put on the 5000 series 20 pound braid full spool hopefully this will help me get a little bit more distance i want to keep the same rod because i throw a nine foot rod man it's gonna really wear me out oh yeah a lot more distance <laughs> damn there we go Fish, oh, God, he cut me off. That sucks. Ooh, it's got whacked. They're after it. Got him. Yep. You don't get me in the rocks. What she's trying to do. Jack. That'd be perfect. I'm actually going to try that for a catch and cook. 
I wonder when the other species are going to show up. Yeah, grunt, grunt, grunt. Okay. Down there for a minute, mister. All right. These guys, they say what you want to do is as soon as you get them, you want to cut their gills and bleed them out. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Stick him in there and let him bleed out. Where'd that go? Uh-uh, I didn't see. Holy crap. Oh, there we go. Spanish. Yep, nice Spanish. Get up here, nice Spanish. Oh yeah, sweet. Get him in this. Get him to chill out in this bucket. <laughs> He's gonna flop off. I let him flop off in the bucket. Better hurry up. If that's one, there's more than one. nice ones you just chill out dude no pun intended good I better hurry up and get back out there oh it's that sea turtle again there's two of them there's another one right here by the rock Three of them. Good lord. These two are chasing each other. You got one coming to you. That's neat. I guess they're playing. Get out of them rocks. Another Spanish. No, it's a jack. I want to say, oh, see you, buddy. <laughs> That's fine. I didn't want to keep that one either. I just wanted one just to experiment with. Got one. I think. Or he's coming at me. Oh, I got him. A little Spanish. God, he ain't even fighting. <laughs> I don't know if he'll make it. I have to find out. He's pretty small, a little schooly. Yep. Twelve inches at the fork. Thirteen at the fork. I'll keep him. Screw it. Ain't that big, but he'll still eat. Going out to the jetties in a tiller drive. That's a new one. Got his dog with him, though. Hang on there, Spike. Oh, God, there he was, right there. He just took it. Look at him. See him? Dang it. There went my last plug. Crap. All right, guys, had to make a run to the tackle store. 
they took all my gotcha plugs they kept attacking the swivel and cutting it off so don't put a swivel on there hopefully it'll last longer yeah there you go get him Woo, something good <laughs> mike's hooked up you got something nice again i'm all following him Take that with you. <laughs> Jack. You want to try it? There's a kitty. A fat kitty. Oh, I got one. I don't know what it is. Be a Spanish. It's a Jack. Jack. But something. Run, run, run. Hold on, dude. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Right, right. Later, buddy. Oh, right here. Stay hooked up. Stay hooked up. Spanish. Yep. Uh huh. Get him. Woo, he's putting up a fight. Let's see, Mike. Let it be a Spanish. He's running into the rocks like one. Hurry, hurry, hurry. <laughs> Damn nice Spanish. Finally. Finally. Mike finally calls Spanish guys. <laughs> the happy dance. What you got? Big blue. <laughs> it's real nice of them. That a freaking. Hey Richard, channel's over there. Appreciate you. Oh man, you got one. Jax, still, if you want to catch one, they're all right here. <laughs> they're all like cookie cutters. Bro, calm down. I can see out of this situation. There we go. Finally, big old Spanish. Throw in there, Mike. They're all. Oh, it's a Jack. No, it's a blue. What is this? It's a blue. Big old blue fish. Well, at least it's something. He'll chill out in a minute. <sighs> That's it, guys. That wraps up the day. If you stuck with me this far, I appreciate it. And also, a little bit of news. Uh, me and the guys of the Bait Shop Talk crew started our own Facebook page. So go ahead and head on over there and join the group. That way you can talk to me and all the other fellas and all the other members. I think we're up to around 250, 300, around that. I'll leave a link down in the description below, so check that out. And also, uh, go ahead and leave me a thumbs up for Fishing with Mike today. We did pretty good. If we could only caught everything that we had on the line today, that'd been awesome. And click that subscribe button and smash that bell right next to it so you get notifications. Oh, and also, if you guys want to see me do a clean and, uh, clean and cook video on these fish, tell me down in the comments below and I'll gladly knock out that video for you guys and see how I can cook these Spanish. And my first time trying Jack Gravel, I'm sure you're definitely going to want to see that. So let me do know down in the comments below. Guys, thank you always for watching Dinsmore Outdoors. Remember, we do more in Dinsmore. Y'all take care. Enjoy this nice day.